Hundreds of Virginia students left classrooms this week to protest Governor Glenn Youngkin's effort to scale back pro-transgender policies in schools. The walkout was heralded by some media outlets as a slam dunk sign that teenage LGBT rights have won out. However, the issue is far from closed. In the 2021 election, former Virginia Governor Terry McAuliffe blew his chance at beating Youngkin by suggesting parents shouldn't tell schools what to do. Youngkin's office recounted a handful of stories about parents walking out of school board meetings across the Commonwealth to protest proposed transgender rights policies. The proposed policies included giving transgender people the right to enter bathrooms or participate in sports as their desired sex, not the one assigned at birth. The Biden administration is also pushing a liberal policy change to Title IX to let transgender college students go either way in sports and other activities, which has become a hot issue leading up to the midterm congressional elections. New polling from CRC Research found overwhelming opposition to liberal gender rule changes. With the elections around the corner, the polls suggest that most voters would not support candidates who promote biological boys competing in girls' sports. Of those polled, most believe that letting men compete with women undermines the achievements of women and Title IX itself.